Advent meditation can be done through prayers. Today's time is very much different from before. Many years ago, a lot of people were quite religious, although there are still very religious persons nowadays, the number have greatly decreased. Even Advent seems to have a different meaning now and most individuals are looking forward to it because they just want to have a vacation. When does Advent begin? If you have no idea whatsoever, Advent starts four weeks prior to Christmas. This is also known as the season or time of preparation for the birth of the Lord Jesus Christ. Personal agendas and family schedules are filled with programs, meetings, annual obligations, and parties. What they often forget is the time of Advent. This is the best time to meditate as a family so that their bond will become stronger. This is definitely the time to be close to one another, especially as a family. Most of all, every individual must have time for God. How can individuals achieve real peace and quiet in God's presence when all they think about are carpooling or manic shopping, instead of contemplation and meditation? You should lower your sight to time spent on lengthy litanies or readings and around the hearths. Between parking lots crash and traffic jams, and decking your halls and scribbling notes. There may be enough time, perhaps 5 to 10 minutes, when your family can sit around the advent wreath quietly. You can do this once every day or once a week. Or if you're really that busy, you can do this at least once during the time of preparation. The family can prepare a simple yet special recipe for them to eat together as they light their advent candles. You can meditate or pray briefly and afterward, enjoy your feast. This activity can bring the family closer together, and much closer to mysteries people celebrate and contemplate in advent. Advent is not about vacation and parties, it's about being closer to God and your family. On the first Advent week, chapter 13 verses 33 of Mark is the Gospel. Jesus told his disciples to watch constantly and stay awake because no one knows when he is coming. Usually, the prayers or Advent meditations for this week has something to do with the Gospel. And this is the same with the second, third and fourth week of the advent the second week's gospel is about john the baptist when he first appeared and preached in judea the third week is about jesus and john's disciples and the fourth is about mary and angel gabriel it's not hard to find copies of prayers used during advent you can see religious authorities and request copies of it or you can also obtain a copy online. With a little research, you can get a copy of a simple yet meaningful prayer that your family can utter when you're meditating. Meditation is not all about proper posture and positions used when a person meditates. A simple prayer is already considered a meditation if you've focused your mind to it as well as your heart. Don't forget to meditate during Advent time.